Chris, yes. we have um, uh, Polio is one of the top bestsellers, and so is uh, Baby Bell's Light little. Um, yeah, that's yeah. That's yeah. what they're referred to. Yeah, so those are the kind of the two biggest bestsellers in the office. Why would you say, if you did an instant analysis of that, why do you think that Pop Polio is probably a better seller than the, the Baby Bells? Well, it's sort of like the, that, the, that, the woman that you interviewed earlier about the banana. It's sort of self-contained. There's a wrapper. And it seems to be the perfect amount of snack. And no matter how people eat them, whether they bite them and chew them or pull it apart like string cheese, it's not only tasty and nutritious, they're fun to eat. Right. And what does it say to you? What does it say to your fellow employees that you're eating polio versus... Well, more belt. than likely because polio string cheese was such a big part of South Beach, Beach diet that some people would think you're on a diet. That's good? That's a good thing. Yeah. But it's a good snack. We should have gotten filled for the